How'd you sleep, babe? I cheated on you. What? I'm so sorry, babe. I didn't mean to. Babe, with who? My ex. Oh my god, John? No. Jeff? No. Justin? No. Jesus? Yes. Oh my god, babe, when? Last night. Where? In our bed. Babe, was this a dream? It still counts. You only say that because you get mad when I cheat on you in your dream. Yeah, okay, because that makes sense. <sighs> babe, do you want to get back together with your ex? No. Do you want to have sex with your ex? Ew, oh my god, no. Are you unhappy in your current relationship? Babe, no. Then what's the big deal, babe? It's your brain just doing some laundry, that's all. But it felt real. And I had feelings. And those feelings felt real. Look, when I have dreams about my exes... What? Nope. Babe, stop. When I have dreams about my exes, I know it's just my brain processing old stuff. It's just emptying the trash can. It's my brain dealing with things in the recesses of my mind. But what if it's not? Well, what? What if it's because subconsciously there's a key component of our relationship missing and you're feeling nostalgic for your ex because they're the best sex that you ever had? Is that how you feel? No, I'm just saying, what if my brain is processing all of that in the background and then delivering it to me in a dream? You would know if you felt that way. But what if I didn't? You would. But what if I didn't? Then I guess eventually you'd figure it out and break up with me. <gasps> you wanna break up with me? What? No! Babe, you just said that you would consciously realize that there's a key component missing in our relationship and that would drive you back into the arms and the thighs of your ex. I did not, babe! You're the one who cheated on me! Babe, it was a dream! Exactly! Babe, what is really going on? What do you mean? You wouldn't have that dream unless something was going on. Do you think that maybe you're afraid of the intimacy we're developing and this is just a subtle means of self-sabotage? Wow, babe. That's incredibly insightful, babe. I don't know. I guess maybe my brain's doing some laundry about the past. It is retrograde. Yep. And our one year anniversary is coming up, so that could be activating like a lot of my abandonment fears. Totally. And Jesus hit me up on TikTok yesterday. What? Yeah, he sent me a TikTok of this kitty riding a rubber. Let me show you. Babe! Oh my god, babe, Jesus, what? Yes! It's Jesus! That's why you're having dreams about him because he hit you up yesterday. Oh. Uh... <laughs> 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 oh my god. I'm sorry, babe. What'd you dream about last night? I had a dream my dad went down on me. Hmm. You know, I've had that dream too, but with my mom. Hmm. 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 I'm Anna Akana. Dreams are pretty freaking weird. And thank you to the Patreons for supporting today's video. And as always, thank you to my father, Daddy Squarespace, for sponsoring today's episode. So if you don't know that my dad is the easiest way to host and create a website by now, I really don't know what to tell you. Because building a beautiful online presence and running your business is so easy with my dad's all-in-one platform. He has marketing tools, analytics, and multiple contributors can receive selective access to your website manager. What more do you want? Oh, just everything, Daddy? Well then don't worry, you own all the content that you put on the Squarespace platform and he offers one-click daddy portability. You can go to squarespace.com for a free trial and whenever you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com Anna to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Daddy Squarespace.